Hello friends, this is an overview video. So I just want to show you how you can create uh, Azure storage account means if you want to replace your file share with the Azure storage account file share. So how you could do that. So in my case, I have a created here. So go to the Azure storage account and if you'll see here i have created the storage account here and if i'm going to file share i have created two file and if you'll see identity based access which is already enabled i have configured that so i'll show you how you can configure so in my case i have already uh, powershell command so you could download this command on microsoft website I will link in, in this description so you could download this so you just need to get the download AZ hybrid module and uh, from the github website and then just you need to import that after you will require some of the command which is subscription ID resource group and all those stuff so you'll get you'll get everything easily and just you will hit the these things this will join the domain and in my case it has been joined so your computer will be appear here so you will see as your two files here so this has been added here so what i did after adding so i set the some permission so i i took the uh, remote access sorry uh, smb access uh, using access key and then i just changed the things from there so let's do that so I have already done that but I am showing you how you could do that. In my case I got multiple error. So make sure I will show you that one as well. So I have an AVD environment. So after that I just sorry I after created the DFS namespace. And in the DFS namespace I added those path here and here as well. And those path is uh, communicating from the one single path. So if you wanna access these both file from single path, so you can access. Just duplicate that, and then you will see you will have to access. So I have given the permission using the uh, group policy, and also I have mapped this drive using enforce the drive using group policy to the all the machines. So they will be enforced to the user as well. And uh, if I will log in one of the user, I'll show you I have what permission I have given. So here is the username Matt. Here is that AG share. If I'm going to log in with this user in the AVD environment, just run admin add whatever the password you have and you'll see my share drive should be so up here so i've added the share drive here using the group policy and that drive is showing here so you could do according to your requirement so this is the way how you can access via the uh, portal things so that's all for myself and if you have a more question just pin in the comment i'll try reply for you thanks for that